What's up guys? Today, I'll be telling you all a story of the time that I drowned and almost lost my precious life. So sit down, relax, and let me get to it. One Saturday morning of June 2017, my mom woke up feeling kinda rich. So she decided that she'll surprise her precious kids with tickets to one of the best swimming pool hotels in my city at the time. Usually whenever my mom felt like she wanted us to have some fun, she'd always take us to the beach. But this time around, it was different. She wanted us to fill the pool and have an exciting experience with it. Now, I'm not gonna lie. This was the first time I was ever gonna be in swimming pool water hell. It was everybody's first time, so the three of us were all excited. We arrived there and went in the bathroom and changed to our swimming gear. Now my brother, he's the goat. He can swim from any end to any end of anything. As long as it's liquid, he can swim in. My little sister, she didn't know what the hell she was doing. But all she had was baby swimming supporters gear and passion. So she was set. And for me, all I had was my height and the water depth, meaning that when the water reached my chest, that's where I'd end because I was not taking any risks. I was never gonna go on the deep side. Now, we're in the pool and a part of me just starts getting bored. I mean, I would say bored but more of embarrassed because when you are alone and everyone your age is swimming on the deep side and you are the only one on the shallow side slash the kids side, you just start hating that, knowing that I cannot swim and really want to save myself from that embarrassment. I came up with an idea. I decided that I was going to hold on to the sidebar and take a leap of faith by holding on to it and go all the way to the deep side while holding on it. Okay, okay, Raybon, you can do this. One step at a time, just like a young baby. Three, two, one. Let's go! I start my journey and it went on well. I reached the other side and came back. Did it again and it was fire. Did it a third time and I was already feeling like your boy Phelps. After having a thousand rounds going back and forth the deep and the shallow side, I decided that, oh, let me go outside and grab some juice. So I go outside the pool to where my mom was sitting and grab myself a fresh cup of some soda. And after that, went back to the pool and continue doing my thing. Now, as I was doing my thing on the deep side, I noticed something. I saw this dude swimming flawlessly underwater. And what shocked me was that this guy was, um... Don't cancel me. He was fat. He was like me times three. And also, he was really short. Now, when I saw him, I was like, hold up. If he can do that and he's bigger than me, that means that I also can. All I gotta do is flap my hands and my legs. So I let go. Horrible mistake, I shouldn't have done it, I should have not let go, man, do not trust fat people in the pool, cause right then and there, I started drowning, man, and for some reason, the water was pulling me down and gravity was my enemy right now. And as I kept going deep, my feet wasn't touching the bottom, so I kept on panicking, man, I tried to swim going back up, but it was just insane, bro, I could not do it, I could not swim, I never took swimming lessons, so, I was dying, guys, I was dying. I was sleeping gulps of fresh ice cold pool water every time I opened my mouth trying to catch some air bro. It was a bad experience, horrible experience bro. I was running out of strength, I was running out of breath, I was, I was, I was. <coughs> oh shit. <laughs> Bro, you drowned, man. You you are dead, bro. Ah, oh, dang it, man. Did anyone see though? Nah, nobody saw that. Only me, which means that I'll be laughing at you for the rest of your life, bro. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. More of the story, guys. Take swimming lessons. You need them. What's up guys? Hey man, look, look, I know I was gone for a really long time and I'm really sorry but I just had a lot of shit to take care of and yeah man, I'm sorry but like, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back and I'ma keep on uploading videos like I'ma keep you all entertained and thank you for being there for me and waiting for me for all that time man, I mean, I know, I know I let y'all down but you still rock with me and I like that, thank you guys and all I'm trying to say is that I'm back and I'm 
I'm gonna keep on entertaining y'all. So please, please, guys, please come on, man. You know, I need that. Please subscribe to my channel, man. Please subscribe, guys. Like, we need that. We need that. And yeah, man, like my videos. If I made y'all laugh or entertain you in any kind of way, just help me out, man. Yeah, that, that's just it. It ain't so hard to hit on the subscribe button. Yeah, that's just it, man. Anyways, I promise y'all that I'm gonna bring content, better content, nicer videos. And yeah, I'll make sure to keep y'all entertained. With that being said, uh, live life, enjoy it, 